A special group at a local middle school is teaching students how to be the best they can be no matter what struggle they might face. It's only been in session for one year, but students say it's already changed their lives. Fox 28 News reporter Dora Miller has details on what this group is accomplishing at Franklin Middle School. Dora? The Trendsetters group is a safe place for 7th and 8th graders. The teacher who started this group about a year ago says that she decided she wanted to meet a need that she saw within the students. The trendsetters in this group aren't bogged down by appearance or by social status. Everybody's the same no matter what color skin you are and no matter what you do. It's about potential. Everybody in this room, you know, have um, different talents and, you know, have a purpose, you know, and a reason. I expect so much from each and every one of you. The students call her Miss Johnson. She calls each one of us her little babies or pumpkin. Her group gives students a safe place to just be themselves. It's like the only time in school where you get to like act yourself, but still in a school setting. No requirements, no judgment, just one rule. What happens in group stays in group. Whatever happens in group stays in group. In this group, like we all have different situations, you know, family, you know, in life, you know. But the thing is, whatever we, you know, say, we keep inside and we help each other out. And there's one goal, one reason these students come here at the end of the day. To be the best, to be the best that they can be and to not let somebody else's view, some stereotype, themselves, their parents, anything else, um, get in their way. Ms. Johnson says her time, money, and efforts are to help those who don't feel like they have a voice. Honestly, I don't, I don't really see that much, but she obviously sees something. She believes in us. They're great kids doing great things, and um, the sky's the limit. They're going to be great. Most of the students are heading off to high school next year. They say thanks to this group, they feel a little bit more prepared. Covering the corridor in Cedar Rapids, Dora Miller, Fox 28 News.